literally my first time on the bike, man. Oh! <laughs> We got Mike right here as the uh, bike model. It's funny how I get rid of the road glider and I got all these long ass trips planned now. <laughs> it sounds great. Yeah, let's. <laughs> what? White bike, white bike, white bike, brown bike. Brown bike. <laughs> <laughs> We're officially at the uh, Tour Custom Cycle Shop, all gearing up to go to the uh, Rut Classic Bike Show today. Then we got a white bike, white bike, white bike, brown bike. First initial ride on the bike after we got the uh, stage two done and the bar set up. So um, yeah, it's gonna be my first take on the bike. Literally my first time on the bike, man. So let's see, uh, yeah, let's, <laughs> what, oh, guys, go watch the install video, if you haven't watched it yet, of us installing the stage two on this bike, yes, I was part of it, I am now a renter, oh my god, how good does it feel to ride a bike that's not stock anymore, man? I, I not not to say that I hated riding my bike, but it's just not the same way. You don't have an exhaust on it or any type of work, and it's just it's not that fun. Oh, this sounds so good, man! So. Stage two with the uh, 483 uh, Psychorama cam on here. This cam sounds great. Combined together with the uh, SB Concept exhaust, the, this, it just, the sounds that comes out of this bike is just awesome. Oh! <laughs> what? Yo, this thing sounds crazy. Oh my god. Yeah, uh <laughs> I I I can't. I just it just puts a smile on my face. I was really surprised with the um how good this bike sounds and now the way it's performing even better the numbers that we got on the dyno which is going to be its own video that video might not be posted up yet so i don't want to spoil it for you guys but we got some good numbers yeah we got some really good numbers out of this bike Really, really strong gains, and I'm really happy with them. <laughs> Yo, this thing sounds so mean. This has to be the sickest setup that I've had for a stage two. The sickest setup, man. Power band is just there all around, but north of the 3000 rpms this thing just starts climbing 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 makes a lot of power on top everybody kept telling me to go with the 472 cam again and i'm like nah dude like i'm i like trying new things man yes i loved that cam on my uh, other low rider but this one just getting on this bike now i can literally tell you I like this one better. Sound wise, performance wise, and we haven't really opened this bike up much. Now we changed a lot when we were doing the builds for the stage two. We got the 483 Psychorama cam. We got a 55 millimeter 
Revolution uh, fueling 5.3 fuel injectors. Uh, we got the strengthening kit from SNS on top. Um, obviously, all the goods and goodies from SNS. We got the oil pump, the plate, uh, the cuffs, racing lifters from fueling, and um, a bunch of other stuff. And that SP Concept exhaust. Oh, wait, guys. I highly recommend this exhaust too. If you guys are interested in buying that, I do have an affiliate link down below. Check that out. This exhaust, woo! <laughs> it sounds great. First initial ride today. Um, tomorrow we're heading up to Laconia. So that should be a five and a half, maybe a six hour ride up to New Hampshire from New Jersey. Super excited for that ride. I did it for the uh, 100th anniversary, um, had a blast up there, beautiful roads up in that area, really, really nice. Um, this time around we're going to be doing more riding around the area, so I want to be able to go up to Mount Washington, so we're going to be doing that tomorrow's Thursday. We'll just head up, we'll stay locally around the dealership and visit the vendor sites and all that stuff. Then Friday morning we're going to wake up. And we're gonna head up to Mount Washington. I'm actually gonna be heading up there with my buddy Willie right here. He's on the road glide. That's a sick setup right there. Really sick setup. Um, we'll, we'll do a its own video for uh, for that bike because that that bike deserves a lot of glory and a lot of just a lot of attention. Sick build. It's funny how I get rid of the road glide and I got all these long ass trips planned now on this smaller bike which I'm really comfortable doing it on. I'm um, really excited to put a lot of miles on this bike, but we got the New Hampshire trip this weekend. Um, then we have um, Milwaukee next month. So that's gonna be about a 900 and something mile trip, about 13, 16 hours, something like that. Um, and then later on this year, I also wanna ride up to Canada as well. So a lot of long trips. And I need gas. <laughs> if the bike you're riding does not put a smaller face when you crank down that throttle, you're on the wrong bike, my friend. You're on the wrong bike. I know you guys are also gonna ask me, how is the feel with this new riser setup? It feels great. I don't want to give it like an in-depth feel review yet. I mean, first impressions, yeah, it, it feels great. But after the the long trip that we're gonna be taking, I'll be um I'll be doing a follow-up video on that for sure. But as of right now, it feels comfortable. Got a nice slight bend right here to my elbow. Very good height. The gauge is very visible. I, I love the design of the Krauss digital pod right here. It, it just makes the bike look like real, real pristine, man. Like, it just elevates it a lot more. All right, so here we have it. Oh, Spike. Spike is just looking so nice. A little dirty right now. We gotta polish her down over there. But as you can see here, blacked everything out um, beautiful fueling air cleaner right there this thing looks awesome the pipe the, the coloring that this pipe got from from the dyno is just crazy man look how nice those colors just all mesh together and just complements the, the paint very well we got the uh, black widow creation carbon fiber side covers custom made uh, Lapero tail whip seat in the back. We got Mike right here as the uh, bike model. Daddy. <laughs> MK87 on the back. I think it looks sick, man. Um, SP Concept Exhaust, like I was saying. Um, what do you have? Centauro Crash Bar. A10 setup. Baja lights in the front. Um. PSR shorty levers, love these things as well. Brand new riser and bar setup 
from Krauss. Thing looks amazing. Arlenes uh, grips, Clockworks, eight inch bronze windshield. Um, am I missing anything? I think that's it. I think that's it. That's it, man. Um, loving the new setup. Can't wait to put more miles on the bike. I want to give you guys a lot of feedback on, on everything as time goes by and progresses. And yeah, thanks for watching. If you want to see more content on this bike or just more cool content on these other bikes, make sure to tune in, like, comment, subscribe, hit that bell button, share the video with your friends. And like always, guys, let the force be with you. Ride safe and enjoy the ride, baby. Peace.